Last thing I want to do is upset my brow girl and be out here looking like AB. dry face is moisturized and protected from the sun but my lips was about dry as hell i am about to head out as you can clearly see we are going to my eyebrow appointment so i guess you can consider this the start of my first maintenance vlog now like i said in a fairly recent vlog i'm a low maintenance so we're going to see how this goes. I actually just recently started getting my brows done again. It's been literal years because, you know, we've all been burned by the brow spots that have been. Is y'all going to stop at this damn light? Anyway, at this point, I feel like most people can relate to all of the bad brow experiences, whether it be, you know, being burned by some wax, having a reaction to the wax, over plucking, etc, etc, etc. So for the last couple of years, I've just been maintaining my brows myself. They haven't necessarily been good, but you know what I'm saying? They've been maintained. In comes Bobby, who is a friend of the family and does really good work. She actually maintains Mama Tress's brows and I shade Mama Tress's all the time because she didn't give me her thick luscious full brow but that's neither here nor there i'm headed to bobby now she's going to give me what i think is called her platinum brow which is of course you know the wax tweeze shape and clean up situation and then i also get a brow tint just to help them look a bit fuller temporarily of course until i decide whether or not if i'm going to get bobby to do ombre powder which is basically a cosmetic procedure that allows the brows to last for several years respectfully i don't know if that's the same thing as microblading and micro shading i just know that bobby calls it ombre powder won't even lie that's a pretty hefty investment for some eyebrows and two i'm scared so y'all already know that i'm in the car so i have to listen to my music so i'll talk to you all when we get to bobby's do it do it do it, do it, do it now. Real ass bitch, give a fuck about a nigga. Big freaking bag, hold five, six fingers. I don't give a fuck who talk behind my back. Cause the bitch knew better than to let me hear. You got a nigga on your foot that make the world cry. In the kitchen, wrist kiss it like a stir fry. Now she say she gon' do what or who? Let's find out and see. Call the beat. I'm feeling the best it could be. I am pulling up at Bobby's and I thought I was going to be late because of traffic, which is ungood because Bobby is very efficient with time and she don't play. Last thing I want to do is upset my brow girl and be out here looking like AD. So let me text her and tell her that I am outside and tell her that I am on time so I don't cause no problems. Let me get a mask because ain't nobody got time. So I'm just waiting for Bobby to text me back and let me know when to go up to the door. She's very good about spacing out her clients and cleaning up in between clients. I personally appreciate the abundance of caution in this socio-political climate. Just started raining and Bobby just said that I could come in, so excuse the umbrella, but y'all will be fine. Hi. Hey, Sugarfoot, how are you?
Okay. Just in time, my battery is flashing that it is about to die, but shout out to Bobby. If you would like to book her, she is in the Millersville, Maryland area. I'll make sure I leave her information down below. My camera's about to die, so I will see you all later. Two days later. All right, so I got my brows done. Now it is time for wash day because it's a rough situation up under this bonnet. I'm actually about to test out some new products. I'm not gonna tell you what brand it is just yet. It's going to be in a future video and I wanna make sure I use them a couple of times before I bring them to you all. This is actually my second time using these products. So by the time I bring them to you all in a video, I'll be able to give you a very thorough review. And I would like other hair brands to take note with that. Not only did they send me their entire product line, they sent me multiples of their entire product line. So that way I can use it and get a true feel of it. And they're open to feedback when it comes to their product line. Regardless, I'm about to pre-poo and then I'm going to jump in the shower to do my wash day and then we'll reconvene. Days later. Well, my lips are dry. Yet again, it has been a couple of days, and now for this portion of our maintenance vlog, we are going to go get nails done. So I have had these neon nails for about three weeks, so it's time. I actually have a wedding to go to really soon. Are you gonna focus on me? Are you? Thank you. I actually have a wedding to go to really soon and I still don't know what the hell I'm wearing. So I'm going to keep it pretty neutral, I think. But that's the thing with me. Like a lot of times I'll feel like I have an idea of exactly what I want when I go into the nail salon, mainly because if I don't know what I want, it's going to take me forever to pick a color and I'm trying to expedite the situation because I don't really enjoy getting my nails done. But that's another topic for another day. One thing about it, if I walk in the nail salon, even with something already in mind, and another color jumps out at me, I'm going to select that color. But because I have to go to a wedding and I have absolutely no idea what I'm wearing, it's best that I keep it neutral just so it doesn't clash with whatever outfit I come up with. For those... Oh! Girl! You was gonna make the light. FYI, I typically get SNS dip powder on my natural nails. I know that we are in an era of acrylics and gel I pray. A lot of the techniques and designs are really innovative and really cute and creative. But like I say, I'm just a basic you know what I'm saying? Every now and then, if I'm feeling a little spicy, I'll get a design or something. But even then, the design that I typically choose is pretty minimal. So anyway, I'm headed to go see my nail tech, Katie, for my appointment. Katie has been doing my nails for at least five years. Katie just does great work. She's accommodating. And most importantly, with or without this SNS, my nails are healthy. And don't tease me, but I actually just started getting gel pedicures this year. I know, I know. Initially, I didn't see the value in paying that extra money until I finally tried it and I was able to put my socks and shoes right on. Okay. We're gonna act like the camera didn't just fall. I'm just gonna grab a mask. All right. I just realized I don't have my glasses on either shambles so anyway i'll see you inside a few moments later so i'm actually a couple minutes early for my appointment i'm just waiting for katie to finish up with the client that was here before me and then i'll go ahead and start soaking these feet gel so you want to do the other hand first of course you do some say the x 
make the sex back spectacular. Make me look it from your neck to your back, then yeah. Shiver it, come deliver it. Chills up that spine, that ass is mine. Skip the wine and the wine. Yeah, didn't you? Just a for everyone? Yeah. For, why you have to do that? Huh? Why you have to do that? Oh, you do. Oh, mine there? Do you want to be? Oh no, thank you. No. <laughs> I'm popular already. Yeah, I believe. <laughs> Damn, I really miss that When she used to rub my back When I hit that When she used to giggle When your ass would wiggle Now I know you used to sweet sex The pop the meridian Trips to the Caribbean But tonight, no ends You must be uh. used to me crying Crying uh. And another one While you're around Later. Okay, folks, so it is a little bit later in the day. So you all saw the pedicure after my leg massage, which is probably my favorite part of the pedicure. I just wanted to come show you all my nails. I just got the OPI dip powder and bubble bath, a really kind of soft, sheer pink overlay on my nails. And don't judge this now. It's a little bit shorter because I did break it, but I didn't want to go with the tip. We're just gonna we're just gonna let her grow out, okay? But yeah, that wraps up my low maintenance vlog. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. And on your way to watching another video of mine, please make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so 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 much for watching. Please 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 be safe because Rona is out here Rona ing, and I'll catch you in the next one.